Entertaining gentleman with us tonight by the name of Frank Rains, who, uh, when he was on the show some years ago, uh, made some very accurate predictions of what he foresees for the future. So we asked him to join us tonight, and he said yes. <laughs> yes he had nothing planned. Would you welcome Frank Rains? <laughs> Happy 1977. We got all the New Year's out of the way. Okay. How many years have you been making predictions now? About 28 years now, Johnny. Yeah. How do you base your predictions? I mean, uh, well, the fact what's your accuracy wrong. percentage? I would say somewhere between 75 and 90 percent. 75 and 90 percent accuracy? That's... Well, there's a lot of unknown factors that are involved. Has it made you rich or anything? Can you predict the stock market and stuff like that? I don't deal in that. There's a lot of unknowns there, too. So yeah. Okay, in other words, if I ask you, how about if you see something frightening in the future, would you predict that? Or does that I, turn people off? Well, rather than take a chance that I could be wrong and it would upset someone, I really probably would not predict anything that would have a personal tragedy to it. All right, now, let's start. May I ask you a question about the future? I'd be happy for you to. All right. What do you, you see for the country coming, coming up? up? Big part, go ahead. <laughs> What do you, what see, you for see for our country, country coming up in a space picture? <laughs> do you think do you that think the, world the world will find peace at this time? <laughs> Can you tell, tell me if the man sitting over here, the guys... Has... Now, let now, let me... now, hold, hold it. it. Now, wait a second. Now, wait a minute. Hold it. Hold it. Frank, stop it. Come on. Come on. I must... I must, <laughs> I must explain, explain what happened. <laughs> He was, he was on the on show about eight years ago. Give him some black, black eyed peas. <laughs> now, let me explain, Frank. Okay. Let me really explain. We had Frank on the show about eight years ago. You're from Chattanooga, Tennessee, right? Or some, originally, originally, I'm from Alabama, but I'm in Birmingham, Alabama now. And he came on the show, and somebody brought him on, and I didn't know anything about it. And he started this business of repeating things practically on top of you and drove everybody crazy. And you've been doing this at... Uh, you go down to lecture circuits, and you go to a place, and they bring you in as a ringer, right? I have done that. You're right. What is the trick on this? No trick. It's a gifted ability. Anything anyone says in any language, well, I can say the same thing at the same time, and makes no difference who I'm talking to. And uh, I enjoy your laugh, because even though I would laugh like other people, I would tie in right with James' laughter, and, uh, you know, and... Uh, oh, dear. Now, you know, ask him... him say say something funny, funny John. John. <laughs> I want to show you what it feels like. That's, That's embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> and Lola be all right to talk with you, too. I think your singing is great. Thank, Thank you. you. It's really me. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll get home every Wednesday night to watch Beretta. <laughs> Too bad you don't mess with me, me but I <laughs> You know what it's like? <laughs> what, what, one, one second. second. Oh, shut up, Frank. <laughs> One, one second. second. No, one second. Frank, stop it. I want to explain what it sounds like. You hear it? It's like talking to yourself through earphones that are about a second. Would you shut up, Frank? Big, Un momento, por favor. Un momento, por favor. Don't destroy his hombre. He says predict, predict something. something. No, you don't understand, Lola. It's a joke. He's not He's really not a predictor. predictor. He is. He is. Predictor? Me, you just all night like this? Yeah. 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 Well, I'll see you when we get some food. I can't take it all night. No, my nerves can't take this all night. Oh, I see you. Uh, 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 you think I'm getting on this You better do something fast. Yeah. 
Well, we'll get out of here early. early. We can <laughs> <bomb it. laughs> At least I would have been so lonely. Get out of here. <laughs> One, one oh. second, I want to ask a legitimate question now. Go right here. This is so fascinating because when you're listening to other people, it sounds completely different. And then, and then when you start to talk yourself, would you shut up? <laughs> and you and even you get, get the inflection. The inflection. <laughs> right. At the same time, time I'm, I'm saying it. Hmm? Monsieur? Monsieur? Hey, madame. Madame. Nous Monsieur sommes Monsieur aboard Monsieur the avion en route pour Paris. Paris. Let's we'll trust you, Mel. <laughs> <laughs> Let's beat him up. Let's beat him up. Let's beat him up. That's right. We don't want to hear. You're making really everybody crazy. Right. You're <laughs> coming over there. Yeah. We're going to let you have it. Come on. Come on, Let's Come get on Mark. Get up. Let's get it. You just get it, brother. Let's get it. Let's get it. Beat him up. Come here, Doc. If you think this is a put on. Put on. One of the guys who speaks to tell you. Hey, bring him uh, Zeke, Zeke, come on now, just say something. Who is this? Well, you want me to meet him over there? Are you going to bring him over yeah, here? Yeah, he can't do it long, does he? He can't speak it. Hey, 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 I can't speak to that. Where's this Italian speak? Let me speak with Doc just a minute here. Let, let me say, I've never you met Doc on camera before. Doc, I appreciate this band. I know everybody else do. You do a great job. Thank, Thank you, you very much. much. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to know you. Where's that Italian man here? Come here. Come here a minute. I want to see you. Come over here. Let me see you. Come here. Move off. Give me a shield. Come on. Give me a shield. You know when it would be great. You know it would be great to be able to do this when you're having a fight with your wife. And she starts throwing on you and you go right. Well, Frank. Yeah. This is a picture I didn't realize. We worked together 18 years ago. 18 years ago. Down in Chattanooga. I know how to stop him. When you start talking about him, he quits. No, no, I'm talking about Johnny. Look at the picture. No, look at the picture. We were talking about him, and look he started answering you. Look at the picture. We were doing, we were look doing a television show. Monitor. We were doing a benefit or something, I think, down in Tennessee, and I hadn't realized until somebody told me tonight. That was 18 years ago. You were, you were a little slender, and I was a little was darker hair, a little yeah. darker hair than I am I'll now. I'll tell you something you forgot too. Another star was with you that night. He was working in Chattanooga with a TV station. His name from Alabama was Gomer Powell. Jim, Jim Neighbors. Jim Neighbors, I went down there, drove me around That's right. the city. I went down there to do the thing, and he was driving, working for a local station. He drove the car. Right. Yeah, well, this, this is fascinating. Is <laughs> How long have you been able to do this? this? 28 years. You don't you have, have to, to study it at all, all you just learn it. That's, no, just a gift. Just, just a, a gift. gift, right. That's a just gift. gift. Okay, okay, we're going to take, take a station, station break, break out, out. and we'll be right, right back. back. <laughs> don't go away. Right. Just shut up, Frank. <laughs>